This is Camp Raven though. It's a summer camp for children like me. That's me, the Cosmo. I know. Happy fellow, right? Well, let me tell you, things weren't always like this. Tell me. A new recruit just finished signing in. A new recruit? Yes. Has it been dewormed? Twice. Okay. Intel. Corona is described by her mother as a fantasist, a dreamer. We can change up. A bath enthusiast with a passion for photography. Oh, cry me a river. Described by her classmate as an odd ball. Difficulty following rules, short attention span, restless and fidgeting in and outside the classroom. Nothing that a bit of authority and mud dunking can't fix. Has she been primed? Ready and waiting, Scoutmaster. Welcome to Camp Raven Knob. You are here because your antics have not gone unnoticed. You're a minister to society and consequently a hazard to yourself. You need discipline. Fortunately for you here at Raven Knob, discipline is exactly what you shall receive. You can address me as Scoutmaster. I am your higher ranking officer, your chief, your field marshal. To put it plainly and for all to comprehend, I am your superior. Welcome to Camp Raven Knob. I win. What? How did you win? I got the last word. Uh, what word? Bone fuzzle. <laughs> you can't make words up, Mars. That's cheating. It's not a made up word, Peggy. It exists. And what does it mean then? It's a term that refers to being confused or perplexed or just plain flustered. Exactly. It's not fair. I think this calls for a vote. Cosmo, what do you think? The reason why I don't want to play your childish game because I want a little peace. If not 10 minutes, at least five. Hey Luke, it's the new recruit. Oh yeah, I heard she's obsessed with birds or something. Carries her camera everywhere so she can snap away and fill her photo album. Geez, who carries her photo album anymore? And that camera, where even is that? This may seem strange, but we can totally explain. This is the reason Cosmo here was spying on you. What is that? This is the book of Camp Raven Knob, or a good copy anyway. It tells the true soul and spirit of the camp. As well as the famous myth. Myth? The forgotten bird of Raven Knob. The only place I know it breeds is King Pekka Island. Jiminy Crickets, that's just a day's walk from here. Guys, Listen, if we can find proof that it still exists, we can activate the oldest rule in Camp Raven Knob. And what's that? 
With photographic evidence, one of us can overthrow Edgar as Scoutmaster. If we have control, then we can repopulate the King Pecker species. All we need is a photograph. Yeah, and to find the bird. For the bait, we only need something gold and shiny. Well, I know exactly where to find that. Bag. Good luck, Scoutmaster. Yes, come in. Scout leader, it, it's Edgar. What is it, Edgar? Uh, I have some awful news, Scout Leader. Um, I'm going to make this really easy for you, Edgar. If I have to get off this seat, put on my boots, losing my chapter, and no doubt jeopardising my strenuous schedule, I will not hesitate in stripping down your ranking to a tender foot. Now, Edgar, what was it you wanted to say? Don't worry, Scout Leader, it's supposed to alarm everything day, okay? Hunky dory, it couldn't be better. <laughs> oh, we're an Edgar. Y yes, Scout Leader. Be a sport and fetch me a tea, will you? My kettle seems to pack in and my throat's parched. Yes, Scout Leader. There's a good chap. If those degenerates think they can get away with this, they got another thing coming. What are we gonna do, Scout Master? If the Scout Leader finds out, out and listen, we're in a lot of trouble. Don't you think I know that, Margaret? How about we go after them? They couldn't go far. We'll follow their trail. Shut up, Margaret. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go after them. They couldn't have gone far. We'll just follow their tracks. Brilliant idea, Scoutmaster. And when I find them, I'll make sure they never disobey my rules again. Thank you.
It looks like it's your time to shine, Cosmo. Yep, show us what you can do, Captain. Okay, first of all, we need oars. Oh, there you are. I see you found the oars. They're fine. They're just a bit cold. It's 25 degrees. Cosmo, what's wrong? You know how I told you I was a qualified sailor in that? Yeah, you would shut up about that the whole journey. Well, I might have missed a minor detail. I can't swim. Oh, Cosmo, it's fine. Lucky you're a sailor. The job is to stay above water. The Kingpecker Islander. Right, no time to waste. Now what? We wait. There you are! You guys are in a lot of trouble! Rule violation 28. Campers must remain in their TVs until and only until instructed otherwise by their scoutmaster. Rule violation 33. Scouts are only permitted to leave the campus if the scoutmaster is present. Or they have permission from guess who? That's right, the scoutmaster. As expected for your misconduct, it is my responsibility and indeed pleasure to expel each one of you from Camp Raven Knob for the foreseeable future. Come in. Ready? Where does it ever be? Do you have the bus tickets? You know me, of course I do. What's this? It's, it's nothing! Oh my god, Cosmo! I'm not gonna take the picture upside down with the camera. No, look! Holy smokes, it's the Kingpecker! Oh my god, we got in front of the Kingpecker! Izzy, once a photograph taken by yours truly, we shown to the scout leader, things really got moving. It's been yet another glorious summer at Camp Raven Knob. All our scouts should be proud. But there is only one scout master, the 
scout that has worked the hardest and of course holds the title for the last scout to photograph the mythical King Pecker. This year, on the 80th anniversary of the last King Pecker sighting, it gives me great pleasure to present the King Pecker National Championship Trophy to wasn't too delighted to see the photograph of the bird. Perhaps that's because he knows what is written down in chapter 88 of the Raven Knob rule book of 1865, which was whomever happened to be the last scout to have taken photographic evidence of the King Pecker bird in its natural habitat is automatically promoted to Scoutmaster of Raven Knob. In other words, whoever took the photograph runs Cat Raven Knob, like the whole thing. So guess what? That person was me. Welcome to Camp Raven Knob. You are here because you are lucky enough to be called different. Some may call you odd, lazy, or just plain strange. But here at Camp Raven Knob, normal, regular, average, well that is just simply unacceptable. Soon as I got in, I saw fun guy everywhere. You're next. Uh, we're about to jump in the kayak. Look at the kayak, okay? Just look at it. And it's just outside. The, you know. Myself here? God, opening takes two. Look, you get the good seat, I get the bad seat. Yeah. So, we just did, I think, the first hole. <laughs> anyway, it's really good. I dived into the water. I'm feeling great. Don't tell me that I'm ever out of fashion because I'm always keeping up with the new fashion. We're gonna go zip line. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> We're preparing the outfits for the Boy Scout movie. Some special props around here to decorate. Yes, come in! It's ridiculous. They can't even find one stunt double to do one trick, and you're about to fall. <laughs> 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 